in this short video I'm just going to show you how to take your back bench out of your boat. Some boats just have like that single hatch with the seats on the back side here that go behind. That's a little easier sometimes the hatch just pops open or there's a couple latches. This one's a little bit difficult. I don't have to take the bench back the back bench out but I'm going to for this video. Okay, so let's say if I'm looking at the bench, like so, there's going to be screw brackets and on the back side here. And since I installed these speakers, I'm just going to do a quick connect here. So now that I have those speakers disconnected, I'm just going to take a screw gun, like I said, and remove all these bolts. From, from. Okay, so once I get those out, I'm gonna need two hands for that. There'll be possibly another screw in the side here. In your side compartments for your like explosion flap things. See these things will be screwed in there. These things will be screwed in the bottom part so they're under there, so you're gonna to wanna to screw from there. Then, the last screws are gonna be your bracket screws right here on both sides. Now that's in your engine compartment to make this so it doesn't wobble, and right there. So since it's really hard to hold the camera and do this, I'm gonna to have to set the camera down. Okay, I got the back bench out of the boat. It's fairly easy. One more thing, I took my snaps off, but there are actually two snaps here that are sometimes connected on the back. I took those off. And brackets that come on the back wood parts there too. I had already taken those off. So those things are pretty easy to take out. So, and then you're, you can get right to your motor. Very easy. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave links to winterizing and the lower end. Okay, now that I got the four brackets in the bottom of the floor, the two side parts inside the bottom, and I got the brackets in the back of the bench, this thing is free. 